Anathu's eyes turned north towards the baleful black spire that rose up from Demon Scale Heights. He could see Scorn, the blackened spike that jetted up from the heart of the cancerous waste below. It was Adrathian's tomb. Hi, I'm Chris Cruz. I'm the guitarist for Lorengard, and my character is Anathu. Anathu is uh, an anti-hero in the story, and um, those are always my favorite types of characters and stories. And uh, what I like about him and, and what I kind of try to portray in my playing is uh, his chaotic uh, qualities and the fact that although, you know, he's unruly and he can be very violent, there's a strain of good within him and, and he knows he has a purpose um, and he's trying to find out that purpose. Uh, Anathu's journey in Eve of Corruption is really a journey of self-discovery. Um, he knows he has a history and he knows there's a past there that's critical to the story, um, but he's not sure what that past or that history is. Um, and it's really up to him to kind of discover, you know, piece by piece his history and, and how he fits into the world of the Lorengard and how he can help uh, bring order to the chaos. Although I'm the guitarist for Lorengard, I, I also uh, write most of the music for the band as well. And the story is a critical part to the way I write. Um, one of the songs in particular that I think you can really hear the story come to life in is Dragon's Bane. Um, in Dragon's Bane, Anathu stumbles upon the corpse of his father, and within his father is a sword, the Dragon's Bane, and there's a moment in the song in particular where um, he's calling out to his father and, and he can you know, hear him calling back to him, and when Anathu first grabs the sword, there's this really epic solo, and I think that's just one example of how the story is so closely tied into the music of Lorengard. There's a lot that I'm looking forward to in the second story, in the second book, um, Two Shades of Night. Uh, in particular, I think I'm looking forward to how the first story, although it's a story in of itself, is really just building to the real danger, the real threat of the series. And Two Shades of Night will really start to show that threat and, and tell the story and tell the, the true conflict of uh, the Lorengard. And I'm also looking forward to, on a personal level, with my character, Anathu, how he deals with um, his rage in the second book. I think he'll be a little bit more controlled and a little bit more of a hero in the second book, um, but still have that edge of, of not quite knowing what he's going to do next. So I think there's, there's a lot to look forward to in that second story.